Namaste friends, welcome back to the Sarthi technology. In this video, we will learn about file uploading because file uploading is a very crucial part of any backend application. So we will see some examples how to upload the file. And for that, first we need to just import upload file. Okay, this upload file here and let's create one route so app dot post and here endpoint is upload file now because this is asynchronous process so we will use async upload file here upload file ok so file and its type is upload file here we will return just the name of file so file name and this file dot file name and here we have done some mistakes so let's correct this and now let's check okay so here just reload and here you can see the upload file okay and try it out and you can see we have this option to choose the file so click here and you can just upload any file here open and if we execute this we will get this file name so this was the first example in which we can just upload the file we can also upload multiple files and for that but before that we can just okay you can see here the field is required that is file and for that you can just go to this body and here select form data and file the key is file and here select the file so new from the local machine and you can select any file here and you can see the file name so this was the way that you can use to test our API in Postman now again come back to the point so the second thing is we need to upload multiple files and for that app dot post and here upload files async upload files add here now this time we will use list so list of upload file so this way you can just upload multiple files and here list and again it is showing error because we need to just import list and for that here from typing import list ok so now we have this list and the error is gone again just return
file names and here file name for file in files okay this file name here dot file name so this will return all file names now again let's test this so wait for this reload process or you can just do one thing just add one another terminal delete previous one and relaunch this server now here refresh and we have this upload files and try out and now choose the first one you can add one another so and i am also adding one 33rd so okay so i have added three files and just execute this and you will get name of all these three files okay so this was the second example for uploading multiple files but just uploading is not enough we also have to save this file in the server and for that just see this next example in which we will just upload the file and save in directory so for that create one another route app dot post and here upload file save okay upload file save async define file and its type is upload files now we need to save that in one directory and the directory will be for example upload so upload directory and its name will be save or we can just put upload so uploads and now the next thing the file location so the file f string and here dot upload directory file dot file name okay so again let's understand this so this will be the directory in which we will save our file and the file name will be file dot name in this upload directory now the next thing is if the directory is not present there then we need to create this and for that we need to use os so os dot make dir s okay upload directory dot exist okay so here first we need to just import this os and for that import os now we have this os and here we will check if it's exist equal to ok and here true so if the directory is not present then it will 
create now with open and this file location wb wrapped buffer and s buffer dot write await file dot read okay so now the writing operation is successful and we need to just return the result so return message and the message is f string file dot file name file location okay so again let me explain you the first thing is our route that is upload file save and this is the function in which we will receive one file and we are creating two variable one is upload directory and the file location so upload directory is uploads and you can see we don't have any uploads folder here and the file location is file dot file name in upload directory and here we are just checking if the directory is not present then it will create the directory and here with open so we are just opening the file location and this is the buffer and and this buffer will write the file after this read operation successful okay and finally we are just returning the message so let's check this So here you can see we don't have any directory here. First uh, just reload this. And this upload file save. And try it out. We will choose one file here and open. And just execute you can see we have this successful message 538.jpg saved at uploads and then 538.jpg and here you can see this upload directory and here this jpg is presents okay so this was the example how we can just upload the file and save in our server directory so hope you have enjoyed this video in the next video we will learn a new thing so meanwhile please like this video and subscribe the channel see you in the next till then bye